post-study work rights for international students, the Australian government will increase the duration of post-study work rights of international students to strengthen the pipeline of skilled labor. Post-study work rights for selected degrees in areas of verified skill shortage will be increased from 2 years to 4 years for selected bachelor degrees, 3 years to 5 years for selected master degrees, 4 years to 6 years for selected PhDs. A working group will be established to advise the Minister for Home Affairs and Education on the development of this and other relevant issues. Member of the working group will be include representatives from the Council of International Education, the National Territory Education Union, Universities Australia and the Departments of Home Affairs and Education. The group will report to ministers by 28 October 2022. International education will also benefit from $36.1 million the government will invest in visa processing to support 500 search staff over the next 9 months. Minister O'Neill also announced today that work covers for international students will be capped again in June next year following feedback from stakeholders. The number of hours will be subject to consultation with a view to strike the right balance between work and study. Quotes attributable to Minister for Education, Jason Clare. At the moment, only 16% of international students stay on after their studies end. This will mean they can stay on longer and use the skills they have gained in Australia to help fill some of the chronic skill shortage we have right now. Quotes attributable to Minister of Home Affairs Claire O'Neill. International students is an important Australian industry that has been heavily impacted by the pandemic. The outcomes from the Jobs and Skills Summit are geared towards supporting international education and giving the students who earn degrees in Australia in the chance to contribute to the productivity of our economy.